Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. Coronation Street spoilers, scared Lauren Bolton is harassed by secret tormentor as Dark Twist looms. The secrecy has obviously led fans to speculate on who the person might be, with some even thinking it could be Damon Hay, Kieran Griffiths, although Sarah, Tina O'Brien, is currently keeping him fairly busy. There's a twist to this tale in upcoming episodes when we discover a possible source for the money and the gifts, and we also learn that Lauren could well be in danger. Since Bobby Crawford, Jack Carroll, first set eyes on Lauren he's been quite smitten, and in upcoming episodes he and Lauren get closer after he helps her track down some books she needs for her exam. Encouraged, Bobby buys her a bunch of flowers, but he realizes he's got competition when a delivery man arrives with a huge bouquet. Then Lauren's phone rings and Bobby assumes she already has an admirer. Lauren tells the caller to leave her alone. The next day she gets another phone call, possibly from the same person. Although she's just been looking at a final demand from her energy company, Lauren insists to the person on the phone that she doesn't need their money and wants nothing to do with them. If this is the secret boyfriend it seems the relationship might be over as she agrees to a date with Bobby. But there's a shock for Max, Patty Bever, and Sabrina, Luana Santos, as they call round to see her and find her dressed in a very revealing outfit. She's forced to admit that she's been making videos for porn site Ovids, something that her former flatmate Ryan Connor, Ryan Prescott, was involved in for a while. Presumably this explains where the cash and gifts have been coming from, but the fact that Lauren is being harassed by people on the phone is a worrying development and the involvement of Bobby in Lauren's life suggests that this could be the story that producer Ian McLeod was hinting at when he told us. Bobby's going to end up surprisingly in the center of perhaps our biggest story next year which I can't say too much about now. He's got a brilliant classically Coronation Street role to play at the start as this lovable sarcastic classic Cory feckless male, and then he abruptly finds himself in the middle of this huge story next year so I'm really excited about the casting and the part and his role in the next 12 months and beyond.